Hi and thank you for joining me back on my channel, A Search for Passive Income. I'm really excited this week to bring you the results from last week's video. If you didn't see it, I'll leave a card up in the top corner. Please go check it out. Uh, where I tested iWriter, a, a premium writing service where you can order content for your blogs, uh, niche websites. And today I've got the results of that. So quick recap, I ordered two articles from iWriter. One was using their premium service and one was using their elite service. These are kind of mid-level packages. They do have a basic package and they have an elite pro package. The basic package I never use. The English is not their first language for those writers and the content you get is not worth the money. It's very tempting to see $9 for a thousand words. Trust me, avoid it with all cost. And their elite pro service I've not used. It's very, very expensive. It's not something I've even tried. Uh, however, I am willing to give it a shot. If you want to see what sort of quality writers you get using their elite pro service, then leave a comment below. We're kind of talking three times the amount I usually pay for a thousand words if we use their elite pro service. But I am willing to give it a shot. Something I'm actually quite interested in, I, I just wonder what the difference is um, between their elite service and their elite pro. I mean, for three times the amount, we're talking something like $100 for a thousand words. It's got to be good, right? So if you're interested in that, leave a comment below, let me know, and I will uh, do a review of that service if you want me to do so. But for today, let's get into this video. I'm going to show you the raw format, which is the content that you will receive from my writer exactly as you will receive it. I'll also show you once I've run it through my proofreading service, uh, which we are soon to offer on keywordcare.com if anybody's interested. And you'll see the difference between the two writers and the errors we found on both levels of service. So it's very interesting. The results are actually quite surprising. So. Uh, and finally, I'll show you the published content, what it looks like once it's actually on the website with some lovely images and some internal and external links and also some obvious Amazon products on there. So without further ado, let's head over to the uh, site and I'll, we'll take a look at what we receive from my writer. So here we are in the first article, Can Rabbits Catch Human Colds? As you can see, this is the $21 premium writer service for 1,500 words. Uh, and on first reflection, this is the raw article that's come through. And it doesn't look bad at all. Um, it's reasonably formatted. There's some subheadings here, um, nicely split paragraphs. Um, so they seem to be on topic. So to be fair, on first reflection, doesn't look bad. Uh, for spending $21, you'd receive this, uh, publish it straight to your website, and all is good, right? Well, not quite. If we take a look at actually this exact same article, once it's been uh, proofread through one of my uh, proofreaders, let's actually see what um, you're getting for your money. So here we are back in the exact same article. Now this article has been sent to my proofreader who's um, run it through her normal process. However, she's not taken out the errors and grammar mistakes. She's left them in for the purpose of this video. So you can actually see the errors that was within the article. So the article looked okay. You'd be tempted just to put it straight on your website, add a few images, but this is actually what you've you can find within the article. So if you look at all these red little sections, these are errors, whether they be grammatical errors, or spelling errors, or just words that shouldn't even be there, or words that are even missing. Uh, as you can see, look at all these red comments. So these are all mistakes within this article that you could have uh, wittingly published straight to your website thinking you've got a great piece of content, but this is actually what you get. So as you can see, there's a lot of work to be done, a lot of spelling to be corrected, a lot of formatting to be done. So clearly with a premium service, there's definitely room for improvement. So if we go take a look at the elite articles, let's have a look at the difference between those. So here we are in the next article. This was uh, 1,500 words again, but ordered this time through their elite writing service, costing around an extra $10 on the topic of can guinea pigs sneeze. So as you can see, we've got another introduction, subheadings, nicely formatted. 
some bullet points. So clearly you can see from this one, it's actually instantly, it's, it's showing signs that it's, it's, it's more formatted, it's nicely written, it's presented in a much better way than the um, premium writing service. You can see there's a, a lot more thought and a lot more experience in this one. I'm liking the subheadings with the bullet points. So straight away I can I can tell, you know, kind of to the untrained eye that this is definitely um, a better article. But again, is this article perfect? Well, let's head over and have a look at the article once again that it's been proofread and let's see if it truly is worth the extra money. So here we are back in the proofread article from the Elite Writer and let's just see how many red marks and comments there are on this one. Well, to be fair, it's looking better already. Oh, we got one there, they missed the word guinea, a guinea pig. But look at this, I look at the difference with the quality, right? Okay, we've got a little bit of an error there. A little error there, they missed the word guinea pig out, which seemed to be a recurring issue on this article. I don't know if where this writer's from, if they just call guinea pigs pigs. Um, but we've added the word guinea pig in. But as you can see, they said doctor there rather than vet. Mm, interesting. Um, but to be fair, there's hardly any work needing to be done to this article. Now, if you'd have published this directly onto the your website, you could probably got away with this one. Uh, there's only a few grammatical errors in there. Um, a lot of people would have, a lot of readers would have missed those. So, wow! I mean, look at the difference. For an extra ten dollars, you've got an article that I would definitely consider. Uh, you could publish straight away with not too much worry. Um, but let's have a look now. One of the articles, once they've actually been formatted with images and posted onto the website, and let's see what we've actually ended up with for our money. So here we are in hutchandcage.com, one of my niche websites. And as you can see, the article is now live and published. Um, can rabbits catch human colds um, is the first one. As you can see, nicely formatted. We've answered the question straight away to try and win any snippets. Uh, we've got a nice little Pinterest pin there. We've got the table of content. And as you can see, we've now got some nice subheadings, a nice image. A little subheading there, some internal and external links, which is good for SEO purposes, and a video, more subheadings. So yeah, the article's looking pretty good. As you can see, 1,500 words, finishing off with a nice conclusion. It's actually turned out quite nice, so there's absolutely no reason at all why this web the article would not rank. Uh, in fact, it's only been published a couple of days. I've not actually checked the rankings on it yet. I will leave the links in the description below if you want to check them out, see how they're doing. Um, but let's have a look at the second article. So here we are. This is the Can Guinea Pig Sneeze article. Again, it just took me a couple of days extra to uh, format this, just time constraints, etc. Uh, but here we are, published and looking great. Uh, again, we've answered the question very quickly to try and win the snippet. Another pin, table of content, videos, subheadings. So this is the one from the Elite Service. As you can see, they posted some bullet points to make the article look a little bit more interesting. And I think you can tell straight away it does look a little bit better. Um, it's certainly formatted nicer. Uh, it's easy to read. There's definitely more bullet points. It's definitely a, a comparison between the two. You can definitely see the difference. So, uh, yeah, definitely a correlation between paying for a premium writer and an elite service. Is that ten dollars extra worth it? Absolutely. Yeah, I wouldn't hesitate in always paying a little bit extra to use a premium service. So as you can see, there's definitely a correlation in the quality of writing uh, from using their premium service to their elite service. Uh, which one do I use? I use their elite service all the time. I certainly think the extra $10 is worth it. I then pay an extra amount to have each article proofread. I think if you're going to publish content, you've got to and put your name behind it. You've got to be uh, guaranteed that there's as little mistakes in there as possible. 
listen, we're all human. We all make mistakes. Um, even the proofreaders make mistakes. Um, but at least eliminating 99% of the mistakes in the article puts you in good stead. So there you go. As you can see, there's clearly a difference between the levels of writing service that iWriter provides from the premium to the elite. Um, to be honest, both services you can use. It just means the premium service, you are going to have to do a lot more grammar checking. You're going to have to format it a lot more uh, and basically just make it look a lot more interesting. The content that you get from the elite writers uh, is definitely a much uh, better service. Uh, you can tell that the majority of the writers that are on there are uh, native English speaking writers and the quality of the service that you get is just far supreme for an extra ten dollars per thousand words i certainly would recommend using their elite service um like i said at the beginning of this video if you would like me to try their elite pro version which is around a hundred dollars for a thousand words please leave a comment below i'm happy to order a couple of packages and we'll maybe test um, their elite service over their elite pro with two similar types of content happy to do that i'd be very interested to actually see the results from that i mean how good should the content be from uh, for a hundred dollars a thousand words i'm expecting good things from it uh, so if you're new to the channel please subscribe hit that bell button so you'll be notified of any new videos i bring out so you don't miss on anything i've got lots of great videos and content coming out in the next few weeks so thank you for joining me today give us a big thumbs up and we'll see you in the next video